Hiking is happiness. Hiking is happiness. And we're getting ready to go hiking. We're getting ready to go to Iceland. We're going to Iceland. We are going to Iceland. Reluctantly, maybe. <laughs> no, we're going to Iceland. But we're going Let's to Iceland. Go. So, this is our The Road to Iceland video. We are going to go backpacking. And this is what I am going to bring. So, we're going to go through David. David's stuff, and then we'll go through Susan's stuff, and, and we're just going to go one step at a time so you understand exactly what we're bringing. We understand exactly what we're bringing. And this is it for our trip. So, essentially, we have, for our backpacking, we have Mountain House, Energy Bars, Susan's favorite, Stinger Gels, they're like candy, uh, some Cliff Bars, personal cleanliness stuff, Pots and pans, stove, which we will use the whole time we're in Iceland, uh, toiletry stuff, towels, because we will find some uh, hot springs, the big bag, and this big bag is my bag, and it has been to India, Nepal, and now it's going to Iceland. The last time I was in Iceland, I used a different bag, so... This is the ice or the travel bag now, and of course, I got the brightest bag I could so I can find it, and my name is all over it, so I know. So, we have clothes, all the clothes, boots, shoes, camera gear. SD cards. Uh, we've got all our travel plans, airline, Iceland Air, car rental, miscellaneous stuff, all squared away, all verified, all good. This is the uh, bag that I'll be carrying around my neck. It will have room for money. It, of course, has my passport, things of that nature. So this goes with, stays with, glasses, Osmo. Charging things, we have a, a inverter and converter so that we can take care of the power because European power is on a different schedule, so we can deal with all of that. Some knives. It, Iceland has got like a lot of sunlight right now, so I'm bringing this, and it'll never get used probably because there's only like four hours of darkness. Um, power supply when we're out and about, and these are our. You can be powered by solar, all the connecting wires, pillow, hiking poles, tent, uh, sleeping pad, and backpack. So this is where we start. Um, through the course of today, we're going to pack all this stuff. I'll show you how that goes. We're going to weigh it so we know where we're at at all times. And we'll just tell you what our plan is. So... The road to Iceland begins right now. Okay, here we go. We're, we're doing a couple little test things. We're going to make sure everything's cool before we start. One of the things, too, we are bringing is uh, Susan and I both have the same uh, hiking poles. So we will be bring, taking with some new tips. So we'll have those. We don't need the paperwork, cardboard. But new tips will be coming with. Because last time in Iceland, I wore mine completely right out. So we'll have some replacements. Uh, also, we're going to be taking a little pocket rocket. And so we're going to test it. Looks pretty good. So that'll go with... And I think we highly recommend testing something before you get <laughs> thousands of miles away to make sure it works. So we'll start putting our stuff together. Okay, hiking is happiness. Packing the bag, uh, sleeping bag, tent, uh, hiking clothes, warm clothes, 
um, mattress pad, cookware, things of that nature. Hiking poles are down in there. And the idea is this is the check bag. If, you know, something terrible happens and this gets lost, it, we're going to not be backpacking. But we're still going to Iceland and we're still going to have fun. So the clothing will go in our carry-on. I'm going to use my backpack as the carry-on. So we'll talk more about that later. In there will be the electronics, uh, things that you absolutely positively can't do without. So clothing, electronics, we can still have fun with that. Uh, but there won't be food, there won't be tent, there won't be things of that nature. So we'll have to have a different program going on. But in this, we are, in addition to what we have in here, going to put food. Let's see if we can't squeeze this in here. I think we are allowed 50 pounds. So once we get this together, we'll see how much weight we have. Things are looking good. Uh, two pair of gloves, and I highly recommend bringing two pair of gloves. If you lose a pair of gloves, you want to have backup. And I did that in Iceland, and I was very thankful that I had backup. Uh, Sherpa hat, and if you are thinking of a nice wool hat to get, I would highly recommend looking for Sherpa. And you can help the people in Nepal, because these are made in Nepal. They're great hats, really warm, wonderful. Uh, these are just a really lightweight protective glove. If it's raining, you've got your other glove to go on, but these are waterproof. Keep your hands warm, very lightweight, so these are going to come good. And I know it's hard to imagine that uh, a, a uh, buff, we, we have to dress so warm in July, but we do. Uh, toiletry stuff, more toiletry stuff will go in here. And I think that's about it. I might squeeze this in. But that's going to be what goes in the check bag. And we'll get this together and weigh it and take it from there. All right, thank you. The miscellaneous bag, I'm bringing another pair of shoelaces. I am going to bring a uh, headlamp, even though we only have a few hours of darkness. And I typically bring a whistle, just in case, you know, there's some kind of emergency two lighters this is going to be the check bag so knives and the skeletor pliers leatherman that has screwdriver it has pliers it has a knife uh, this is a really this is the way to go the knife can be operated with just your one hand it's a good way to go so that goes in our miscellaneous stuff that we need to bring water filtration we're going to buy a bottle there and then we will fill the bottle from the river and then drink through the filter uh, we do have options for bags and so forth that we will utilize depending all very lightweight everything fits in this bag so we're in really good shape with that that will go in the check bag because if all fails and then my check bag doesn't make it we won't need this stuff anyway we'll be going to a plan b as far as what we do uh i think the rest will be carry on because we have our our um solar powered battery chargers and keep our th stuff going converters and so forth for any place we stay that has that option uh, I'd like to fit this in here because this helps keep our ground footprint for the tent squared away. Uh, and the rest goes in uh, in our deal. I think we're good. So this bag, we just waited moments ago. It was 33 pounds, so we didn't add any more. It's definitely under 50. This bag's ready to go. Happiness is hiking. Happiness is travel. So this bag, this backpack, which is going to be my carry-on, has my clothes pretty well squared away. I'm not going to load the electronic stuff right now, the cameras, all that type of thing, uh, because I'll make sure the batteries are charged and all that. 
Um, this will be the last thing that goes on because that will be my coat when we get to Iceland. On, you know, it's going to be in the 50s when we get there. We're going to go from 90s to 50s. So there will be a little temperature thing, but, you know, not bad. And then this will will make this collapse down to the size for the carry on. We'll tighten all our straps up, tie everything tight together, and then this will be the carry-on size. If I carry it like this, so be it. I've done it before to Iceland, and everything worked out well. So this is uh, the minimum stuff. If our other bag gets lost, this has cameras, clothes, things of that nature. We can still have a great time in Iceland. Um, we won't be backpacking, but we will have a good time regardless. So we, we can't get sidetracked. So that's what's happening for me. Okay. So this is what Susan is bringing with. Uh, it looks like less than what I have, but, you know, tent, um, cooking things, stove, all those type of things take up room that she does not have to bring. So it looks less, but this is just what she needs. So we're going to go with the same program with uh, Susan's. We're going to pack in her bag uh, the things that if they get lost, you know, we can shed a tear, but it won't stop us from having a good time. Uh, her carry-on will be the same. She's going to bring her backpack as her carry-on. So we'll get that squared away and all the straps dealt with. So that's her carry-on plus her backpack. So we'll see how this goes together and we'll let you know how that works and how much it weighs. My bag was about 35 pounds. So we'll see how this does. I think the limit is 50. It's cleaning up. So this has worked out great. Tag teaming this program really, really helped. So we've, we've got both our mattress pads in here. Susan has her backpacking stuff, warm clothes, same program as uh, that I used. And so that's going to work out great. In her carry-on, which again is her backpack, will be her clothes. If everything goes south, we still are all set with the clothes that we're going to go. We are going with a minimal clothing option, as you can see. We're going to be traveling light and fast and enjoying ourselves. You know, it may seem weird to some of you, but we're bringing uh, <laughs> some um, soap that you can wash your body you can wash your clothes, you can wash everything, because when we take showers, we are washing our clothes. And that's just the way it is in Iceland. Um, you'll see a lot of the places that we stay are schools and different public buildings that they convert to um, camping grounds during the um, tourist season. So there's not a ton. We don't plan on staying at too many places. We're pretty much camping unless our bag doesn't make it, in which case we'll, we'll be doing something different. But that's, that's our plan. So that's the way it works. Hiking is happiness is almost there for Iceland. We are on our way to Iceland. Today is Saturday. We leave Tuesday. Yeah, we leave Tuesday. So, we'll bring you with. Come with us. Hiking is happiness. Hiking is happiness. Let's go to Iceland. We're going to Iceland. Oh, my gosh. Come with us. Come on. And we're going to be on Instagram. Of course, this will probably go on Instagram, but we'll be on Instagram, and we're on YouTube, too. All right. Take care. Bye. Bye. So, forgive me, but what are we doing? We're weighing my bag. Oh, we're weighing your bag? Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> on the scale. Oh, okay. See what we also have. Um, we, we got the TSA locks, so this is locked, and TSA has a uh, key that fits this, so it's it's they're certified, and uh, so it's locked, so you know people can't get into it. And this kind of worked before. You may no, have to. You get on the scale and weigh. See what this says. That doesn't work that way. About 30 pounds. Okay. About 30 pounds. I think that's pretty good. 
We're pretty close, huh? You want me to do it too? Yeah, I want you to weigh on there and then hold. She wants everybody in the world to know how much I weigh. Okay, so. Well, you don't have to say out loud how much you weigh. Well, you've got it written down. Uh, yeah, okay. I have it written down how so, much you weigh. Here we weigh. go. So just. Two sixty, right on the money. Okay, we're good. Two sixty, so we're like less than yeah we 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 have we're in pretty good shape we're yeah. pretty good shape so these are obviously our see this isn't bad at all this isn't bad it's we didn't have to buy the wheel thing because i can easily with my backpack mine's far heavier but i can carry these no problem Okay, I'm feeling better about it. I've been a little stressed with the packing deal, so Look at here. We got our bags packed I can breathe huh? And I'll be getting my backpack packed for my carry-on Okay, deep sigh On our way now Feeling much better about this whole thing